Thank you, Kitty. It was great. So all the product from TT Esport, it will be available to you soon. No, no, no. Hold on a second. It's not end yet. It doesn't end like that for Thermaltake. Hi, my name is Arthur with Thermaltake USA, CES 2013. What I'm going to introduce to you today is basically our cooling products for Key 3. Basically, we're starting off with our 760 Pro. This is basically a revamp of our old 760 Plus. We've included basically a new water block design, heater core design, as well as pump and compression fittings. Um, next up, we've got actually our Water 3.0 series. So basically, this is another uh, upgrade over our Water 2.0 series that we released uh, earlier this year. This basically has a more efficient pump. Um, basically quieter fans because we took a lot of feedback from the community and basically the fans were just a lot louder. So basically we just improved them, made them a lot quieter for everybody. So we have three different versions of that model. Um, lastly, we've got here our Nix series. Our Nix series is our air cooling line similar to the Frio. Um, but what we did with this is we modified it so that you can actually fit higher heat sink memory. Uh, the issue before was with motherboards and high heat sink memory is that the coolers would interfere. So you would have to be using lower profile memory. But now we've solved that problem and made it more compact. This right here is the S41. This is a, another elegant case that we're, we're releasing for, uh, for CS 2013. It includes our signature docking station that uses SATA. You have your front, front cover, basically aluminum cover, USB 3.0s, audio jacks. Cover opens, you have your filter, 120 millimeter. You can actually even fit 140 millimeter. Another nice feature to this case, is the side panel. The side panel is all sound deadening and we're actually going to include also an optional side panel for uh, windows. Introducing here at CES 2013 is our line of notebook coolers. Now we've got here the Life Cool 2. This is mainly for home use which you can also use the office. It's got a nice aluminum plate for your cooling, flat finish you know, for cooling for your laptop, nice padded, uh, padded construction as well so it's very comfortable on your lap. Um, comes in a wide variety of colors. You know you have your, your baby blue, your red and black, your light green, and then your yellow. The last product we have here is actually called the, the Gorb 2. The Gorb 2 is a portable laptop cooler. So basically you detach, it's held by, by magnets, and it's got two 70 millimeter fans. And basically you, you lie down the, the mounts and you lay your, your laptop down, and it's powered by USB connection, and it's a pass-through so you actually don't lose the port. You still can use your USB for data or whatnot for your flash drives or external enclosures. So that's all we have for CS 2000, uh, 2013. I hope everybody enjoyed it and we will see you next year. Next up, we actually have our line of peripherals uh, for CS 2013. We have our Max 5 Duet in both three and a half and five and a quarter inch. Basically these will fit uh, any of your SSDs or two and a half inch uh, mechanical hard drives. Uh, next to it, we actually have our Ultra X. It's our USB hub. It actually comes with an Ethernet USB adapter. So basically if you're on the go for mobile and whatnot, you can actually connect it to your laptop and, uh, and have Ethernet access um, if your uh, laptop or whatnot is limited to just Wi-Fi. Um, lastly, we have our USB docking station. This is our Snow Edition version of our uh, Black X 5G. So these are all USB 3.0 and all powered by uh, AC adapter. And this is mainly for uh, storage and uh, cloning and uh, data recovery. For CS2 2013, we're actually releasing a new line of cases. It's actually continue on our Chaser series. We have the A41 Snow Edition and the A41. This is going to be the Black Edition. So we're actually toning down the design a little bit. There's going to be a little, a little less uh, radical design, a more simplistic uh, uh, exterior, a lot more aesthetically pleasing. We're actually including now uh, the option for a side panel with window versus uh, in previous generations we've only included side panel. Uh, fan, fan configurations, but now we're, we're jumping into the side windows for a lot of our mid-tower configurations. And then we have our A31 and A71 now. The A31 is going to continue with the A41 as, as a mid-tower case, but it is a different design. It follows our A71, which is our full tower. Um, all of these cases will have USB 3.0. Um, again, following the same simplistic design, side panel is going to have windows, but it will also have an option for, uh, for uh, 230, uh, 230 millimeter side fan. Now, the A71 actually has kind of a mix of the, uh, the side panel. It's going to be, uh, it's going to have cooling for GPUs with a 230 millimeter fan as well as that side panel uh, window so that you can see all your peripherals. You know, uh, if you have higher end motherboards with LED diagnostic uh, codes and whatnot, you can actually see everything there a lot, a lot easier. Um, and we're also going to be including with the A31 and, uh, I'm sorry, the, the Chaser A31 series, we're going to be including different colors. Uh, we have our Snow Edition as well as our new Thunder Edition in, uh, in this blue color. Very nice blue color. Uh, we're still playing around with other colors as well, but uh, this should be uh, available uh, Q2, um, maybe in the end of Q1. This is going to be priced around $79.99. Our A41 is going to be priced around $100. And then A31 is going to be around $139.
And that's it for uh, for uh, CES 2013 Thermaltake uh, chassis.